corner coming to you loud live in the color hey my people welcome back to my channel thank y'all for liking commenting subscribing giving me thumbs up thumbs down thank y'all for sharing my videos i appreciate the support i appreciate the love thank y'all so much make sure that y'all comment on all my videos the comments are very important to a channel i still upload six days a week seven if i am doing laughs and libations with my with with my co-host armani jones speaking of laughs and laughs and libations i need for y'all to go over and watch episode one and episode two i am going to make a playlist of the episodes okay i'm gonna make a playlist for all of the episodes so that y'all can watch them okay and it's only two right now we're working on episode three I'm not going to tell you whether the episode is going to be recorded or how it's going to be recorded or how it's going to be done. I'm not going to tell y'all none of that. But I just need for y'all to watch episode one, episode two on my channel. Working on episode three. This is another disabled and video. This is disabled and wanting marriage. I've always, always wanted to get married. I've always wanted that perfect marriage that perfect life that perfect family I, i've always saw myself being married i've always saw it but as i got older and i started dating and meeting men and just going through the dating world and being in relationships and just trying to feel my way through love and life and all of this i now see that maybe marriage is not for me um i don't know what god plan is but whatever his plan is i'm ready for it um but right now i don't see it happening for me i don't see kids in my future anymore i'm 42 I know people are going to say, well, you got plenty of people over the age of 42 or well, over the age of 40 getting married, but there are some risks with getting married over the age of 40, and I don't want to take those risks. I'm already in a wheelchair. I don't want to have a child that's born with a disability or a handicap because I know what I've gone through in life. And I don't wish my trauma, I don't wish my life on my child. I don't risk, I, I, don't, I don't wish the things that I've gone through on my child. I don't ever want my child to be picked on for being disabled or handicapped. I don't ever want my child to be picked on because of the way God made my child. So, I've given up trying to have a child. I've given up on marriage. But if I get companionship, I'm good. It doesn't have to turn into marriage. If it does, great. If it doesn't, okay I'm, I'm 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 good on that fine it don't matter um but yeah i've i've given up on trying to find marriage i mean have a have a marriage and have a child i've just given it up but like i said i don't know what's in god's plan god has a plan for me god, ha god has a plan for me and you know you never know. He may give me marriage and not a child. And I may have to accept that, which is fine. Because, I, I mean, because I, like I told y'all in a previous video, I've wanted a baby for so long. I've always saw myself having a little girl. I've prayed for a little girl. I've prayed for marriage. And I'm still praying for that, even though I don't see it. You know, but I'm I'm, I'm optimistic. Um, I believe in God. Y'all know I do. I believe in God. If I did not believe in God, I wouldn't have gotten this far in my life. I would not have seen the things I've seen. 
I would not have been through the things that I have been through. I wouldn't, I, I mean, there just would not be no me if I wouldn't have gone through the shit that I've gone through. Okay. But, uh, yeah, I just need peace in my life. And I've had to let go of those two dreams of having a little girl and marriage. So if I find companionship, I'm good. I'm happy with that. At least I will not die alone. Um, but if I don't find companionship, I die alone. You know, um, but yeah, I've always wanted marriage. I've always wanted that. I've always looked at other people's marriages and just saw what works for some people and what don't work for some people. And I've always tried to say to myself, well, if I had this type of marriage, this is what I would do different. If I had this type of marriage, this is what I would do different. But you never know until you get into a marriage, what type of marriage you will have and what you will and would not take in your marriage. Your boundaries in your marriage, your red flags in your marriage, you know. So you have to, you have to be in it or you have to be on the verge of getting married to know what you will and will not do in your marriage and outside of your marriage or before your marriage. So, I'm just leaving it up to God. If I meet somebody, I meet somebody. If I don't, I don't. I'm good. Um, but yeah, y'all tell me if you ever dreamed of marriage and did that dream come true for you. Did you ever dream of kids? And did that dream ever come true for you? Comment down below. And in the meantime and in between time, make sure you give me those big thumbs up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell twice to be notified. If you're an old subscriber, make sure your notification on. Share my videos. Like I always say, God only gives you one life. Please do it. Bye, y'all.